Welcome back to One Hour Limit Locked, where I race to complete some of RuneScape's most iconic challenges, whilst limited to just one hour of gameplay each day. In Season 1, we got ourselves a fire cape in 46 days, and in Season 2, we achieved Barrow's Gloves in just another 38. But now, in Season 3, it's time for our toughest challenge yet. The question is, how many days will it take us to complete our first ever raid on the account? We not only have to get ourselves geared and leveled up just to step inside a raid, we then have to complete it in under one hour, as logging out in the middle will end our run. I've no idea how long this is going to take me, but I can't wait to find out, so join me for the journey here in Season 3 of One Hour Limit Locked, as we become a Tomb Raider. The journey is not over yet, folks, but it could end today. Welcome back to episode 63 of season 3, One Hour Limit Locked. I'm not wasting any time, I am getting straight on into this. We know what the plan is, we went over it all yesterday. I did a quick practice run on my main account before this, and it went really well. I'm now actually pausing the timer because I've realised my audio settings are wrong. Okay, now we're good. Click play and carry on what we're doing. Yeah, I did a, a practice run on the main before this and it went way, way, way better than the previous practice run I had. So that's a good sign. It was very smooth the entire way. We're hoping we're going to see the exact same thing today. Well, not today. Again, yeah, it was today. Okay, my words aren't working well today. Let's hope my PVM skills are as we dive on in. I'm going to take a hit for 20 here. Unfortunate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how we do. Getting better at those, maybe. Maybe I'm just more locked in today. Completely forgot all the things I just revealed down here, so... I think there was a knife here. That was a wave. Oh gosh, it feels so weird not having switches over here. I'm so used to it. Alright, Capri. Let's see what you got to say today. Nice, got a spike. Oh, we hit two of them. That's actually okay. Hopefully, we should be able to avoid the majority of damage in this room, aside from some of the scarab spawns during her recharge phases. No mistakes. We shouldn't take too much damage here, so we shouldn't need to worry about the damage that we took in the puzzle room either because we'll just be able to heal up for free at the end all being well and he immediately forgets to pray against those call the double dong set up in the first wave so i don't have to worry about that he's going slowly though very slowly okay we go him down oh shit my pride ran Oh, I was not paying enough attention to that, okay. That made me panic a bit. We're doing good on these swarms, though. We got a decent amount of them there, I feel. Okay, let's just top up that prayer a little more. Alright. We actually... I don't think she fully recharged the shield. She didn't get over, that's for sure. So, we did decent there. I'm not complaining at all. Ooh, did take another hit there from the... Um, Spawn, I'm gonna eat a mana. Just feel a bit safer. In fact, I might throw a speck at this. Yeah, give me that lovely heal. It's not like we have a lot to do with our specs in this room, so... What is that noise? What the hell? What is that sound? Oh no. Ooh, that was clutch. We're actually doing well here. This is a good start. Use one man or one restore. We're gonna use some more restores yet, but that's okay. We brought plenty. Maybe I should bring a combat potion to restart during this fight. It might be worth it. It's like rather than pre-potting, just bring it with us. It's an extra space, so like we already bring a range pot for Zebak. This is so slow. Because the thing is, you can't pre-pot with divines, because they'd be halfway gone by the time you got here through the puzzle room. If I brought a divine in, I don't think the 10 HP would be that much of a worry. It could mean we'd just pre-pot and have the full buff for the whole way. I mean, I don't know, this could be our last 
run anyway if we get this done. But if we do have to make another run, I might consider bringing a divine super combat. I think I'm just going to leave my prayer again. We can make it. We're fine. Please don't prove me wrong. There we go. Whew. Kepri down. Move into the next one. And I, I do apologize, but this is all legitimate. I'm gonna leave this all in so y'all can see. Well, actually, I'm just gonna step away. Oh, I had a long sleeve shirt on under this and it was getting sweaty. So I just turned my heating down slightly and took the shirt under that was on that was, yeah. Y'all know what I mean. Okay. Oh, click this, wait a few seconds before I do anything, which is kind of unfortunate because crocodile spawns, but come on, let's have a nice clean Zebak now to go with the nice clean first Capri room. Didn't bring, I forgot we didn't bring, please let me kill it in time. Yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Who needs water runes? Nice one. Right, I'm going to have one brew dose and then one restore. And then we'll get our range gear on. I need to get this invent tagged, actually, now that it's started degrading. Okay, that'll help me a lot. All right, see if he gives us rubies like he did yesterday. It was very kind to us yesterday. Zebak, I know we were good friends and I know that your buddy Aka put a stop to me. But I would like you to show him how it's going to go for him. That's all I'm asking for. There we go. Couple more, and you're back on the Christmas list. Oh, beautiful. My friend, my buddy, my old pal. Come on, give me one more, and I'll set you up on the best blind date of your life. Just one more. We might skip to spec or two, actually. I'm not gonna be able to do that, am I? That was too risky. Oh no, I don't think we did skip any. Can we hide behind here and shoot? Yes, we can, lovely. Okay, it's a bit late for rubies now, so I'm gonna swap now. Although I may end up swapping back to the crossbow for the next wave phase, just so I can get some more long range shots in. Throw a spec at him. Oh, he's gone into an ridge. Throw another spec. Right, it's crazy how much just topping up that range pot made my hits start turning into misses. Uh, all the way around even. Misses start turning into hits. That was a close one. Thank you, Zebak. That was very pleasant. We are speeding through this so far. Hopefully, Aka isn't going to be nasty to us today. Because look at our supplies right now, folks. We are absolutely loaded up. Absolutely loaded. No worries about taking that power there at all. In fact, we don't need our range pot anymore, so let's just get that banked so we don't have to worry about it. One less invent space to manage. This is a promising start, we just gotta keep this rolling. I feel like Acker is probably the most dangerous room, because Barbar, so long as we don't get caught by the gap, by just bad timing and bad positioning, it's pretty good, it's pretty easy. It's a kind of free room, the baboons can be kind of rough, but... We've got enough supplies that, at the minute at least, that we should be able to handle them, no problem. Aka is the one that can cause some trouble. And that was a really perfect, apart from the one hit I took, phase. Time-wise though, that was like as optimal as it gets. I didn't even realise I'd finished it, but apparently I had. What the fuck are you doing? Why are you moonwalking, bro? I mean, it's not like it's going to make a difference because we're going to have to do three faces anyway, but what the fuck was that? One thinks he's Michael Jackson out here. Oh, going to salt. We've got four doses, so we should be all good to last us through. And I don't want to be walking. No moonwalking this time, bitch. Okay. Put those away. Pick that up. Deposit that. Go in here. Get the liquid adrenaline right ready. Not forgetting it today. We're not going to need this crossbow, so I'm going to move it out of the way. We won't need this anti-venom either. We'll brew once, restore. I suppose I didn't really need to restore, I should say, but a bit of a misjudge there. Yep, yeah, let's get on with it. No, no time to waste, is the No time to waste, he says, wasting more time. Okay, now I'm happy, I think. Am I ever really, truly happy? That's besides the point.
That's what antidepressants are for. On oh, shout out Tass at the Terror for I think that's the name for telling me to use Mage Prayer against the orbs because it makes them hit slightly less. According to the wiki, it's only a marginal difference, but if it's one hit point and one hit point is all we need to stay alive and eat a tick later, then I'll take the one hit point, so thanks for that tip. Keeping a careful eye on Akka right now. Don't want him to change without me noticing. Nice timing on this memory game that let us have DPS on the shadow without the hourglass getting charged up. That's that's very good. Gonna keep trying to run around. Not as much space to do it now, but maybe we can avoid some attacks. Try and mitigate that prayer drain as much as possible from the poke damage of Akka. I don't know, I feel like I'm getting two attacks for everyone now, so I'll take that. Pretty clean switches, reasonable enough. Just gonna keep that prayer nice and high. I don't wanna have to think about it one bit. Keeping an eye on Akka at all times. Shadow down, back into mage gear. May as well try and get some healing in. Just top up that health while he's staying on his mage phase. The nice thing now is, well, on one hand, our mage to melee switch is a bit to get used to because I'm clicking the yellow items rather than the orange ones. And that's such a simple thing, but it actually makes a difference when you're in such, like, muscle memory situations. Let me watch this before I talk. Oh, that's not a good idea, James. Okay, we're fine. What mode is he on? Melee. Nope, he's on ranged. Okay, I was say in the middle of saying something, but I've completely forgotten that train of thought, so yeah. Apologies if you're interested to hear the end of whatever I was about to say. It ain't coming. Something about the difference between our switches now. We are using a lot of restalls in this room. We should be okay though, Baba doesn't take that much. And I always try not to use anything in baboons. Give him some extra heals then. Who is he actually going to end us on something we're pretty much geared up for? Oh no, he's changing rapid now. Nice. No fucking way. How has that happened two days in a row? I got absolutely robbed on my hits there, I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of annoyed, but what can you do? We just gotta keep it pushing, folks. We got some honey locusts, maybe we can make use of them. We had good time on the raid up until this point, so who knows, maybe we can, we can still make a go of this here. I'm not going to have access to that liquid adrenaline though, because I definitely want to save it for later. It was going so well as well. Uh, I'm trying not to lose all hope. Still got 34 minutes on the clock, plenty of time. Let's switch to this thing, it's probably quicker. Oh, I'm not going to make it. I'm going to put this away so I don't drink it by accident. Why did I have to choose the one that was furthest away? He's changing so much today. Changing styles, I mean. Just keep switching rapid. Whenever I look down at my in inventory, I'll look back up and then... Oh, he's on a new style now. Oh, no. Oh, there goes all the honey locusts. I'm actually going demon mode on this right now. Not talking much, but... I didn't even realise we had another shadow. Right, you're fucking dying this time, mate. Fuck you! Suck my fucking dick from the back. I think we can still do this, y'all. I think we can still do it. Okay. We gotta keep it pushing, though, because time is of the essence. Time is of the essence. Alright. We can't really salt here. We're gonna have to salt in Barbar. -bar. So... I mean, I'll take it out just in case, but I don't really want to use it here. Oh, my adrenaline levels are so fucking high right now. 
can we all appreciate the fact that I did just kick a 17? Not intentionally, obviously. Didn't mean to kick the NPC. That's not great, is it? What are you doing? I'm gonna brew. It's okay. We're fine. Just, just stand in the venom some more, why don't you? Some nice blood's coming in at least. Although the prayer is looking worse for wear. Is this it? There's gonna be another phase, isn't there? There's no way this is it. Yeah, thought that was too quick. Oh, lovely heal, lovely heal. We take those every day of the week. Time on the clock is not looking pretty, but we are alive and keeping it pushing. Gonna need this crossbow for the next one and salt up. Gonna have to restore a couple times. We've got basically one full restore. That's it. I feel like we may run out of time today. We may be on track to finish the raid, but the clock runs out because of the death and the time it took to redo that room. What a lovely place for Barbar to be trapped under his own rock. No. Ow. Beautiful stuff. Go for a blowpipe spec there. Didn't do much, but... <gasps> Come on, give me as much DPS as possible here, Barbar. That wasn't bad, I'll take that. Straight we go. Nope, did not swap. Jeez. I don't know if I'm gonna get to the top. I can probably go there. Never mind. Never mind. Let's just chill. Dodge the boulders. We're out of food, we got one restore. Not the best time to throw a DDS book into the mix. Don't really want to be so close to those monkeys down there. These hits are nasty. No, you don't. Oh, no, I swear to God. Not like this. Two honey locusts? I'll give it a try. You know what? Let's throw some ruby specs. We got one salt, who knows? Maybe we can get one in a chaos. Fuck it, let's see if we can just make something wild happen. Maybe I can kite him around a bit too. Try not to move away from the edges of the room though. Maybe I need to deal with these guys. I should barrage them, what am I doing? It's three hit, hit points right there. That I was just ignoring. I mean, it's not going well. Yeah. Oh, that's annoyed me. I feel like that could have been it today. We could have we could have got it done today. If we hadn't died in that first ACA phase, we would have been okay. We were on track. I'm not gonna allow myself to get defeated by that. I I can't. We can do this, folks. We can 100% do this. But can't do this today because I've only got 15 minutes left. So the old-fashioned head back to the GE. Right. We actually need a new elf, don't we? Not much point selling Verax, it's not worth that much. Solar's Renar seeds, gold or whatever. Is there any other seeds we got? Alright folks, we're doing some bone runs. I don't know how many bone runs we're gonna need, but it can't harm to get our prayer up just a couple extra levels while I am 15 minutes at the end of the day. I did actually check earlier and Level 72 prayer would be the next bracket of change for how much our super resource give us back. So if we get, basically if we get two more levels, then our super restores will be giving us an extra prayer point per sip. So four extra points per pot, which is four times eight for the entire raid. So hopefully we don't get caught by any horrible nasty people and we just get to chill and bury some bones on the altar here. And yeah, I went with lava dragon bones because they were the first ones that came up in the search and they weren't that much different from the regular dragons that I'd checked yesterday. Oh, I feel like the last time we were doing bone runs we didn't have access to the chest down here, but now we do. <laughs> Thank you, season two. I hope this isn't real anticlimactic for y'all that we're getting to the end of the season and I just keep failing, but 
we did better than the previous attempt. We got further into it. We did die at the same point, ultimately, and that is probably what cost us the run, but we made it past that point then on the next bit. So I sort of, I don't know, I proved to myself that I can do that phase, even without a liquid adrenaline on this account. You know what I mean? That was a close one. Immediately hop back the other way in case that guy hops through along with me. Just go backwards right now. Oh, why is the people on every world, man? Why is my fucking prayer? The fuck? Okay, it's really busy right now. That's not good, I just lost money. So I just go do it in Corrand? Oh fuck, I didn't get myself another wealth, did I? I just realised I think I said Corrand and I meant Valamore. But yeah, I'm gonna go do it in Valamore on the tier map. So I'm just gonna make sure I get my value out of it by getting some Sunfire Splinters. I don't know how many we need. I can't remember, so that should do for now. And let's just get this up and buy a couple of wealth so that we don't have that issue again. Okay, wine. I don't know if we can mix this in yet. Yeah, you can. I wasn't sure if you had to bless it first. Can you bank this one though? Yes, you can. Okay, that's good. We can do that at a bank. Let's just go get the bones to the altar. Coins. I think we'll just about have enough time to use a polis. Okay, we got almost 10,000 shards there. Gonna be a bit of a hurry here. I'm not sure how much that equates to, I wanted to check it, but it's not showing up on my prayer tab for some reason. I'm just gonna mix all of this. Can we spam it? We can. Why don't we do that while we're running into the thing? Or are they all already? It's really annoying that you can't tell the... Okay. If they're all red, that means they're all sunfire. You yeah, know, we just spam... Oh no, we need to bless it, we need to bless it first. Oh no, I'm out of run energy. No, not like this. Why didn't I drink a stamina? Not sure we'll get back to the raid lobby, actually. Might have been a bit of a overstay on my behalf. I might have to get out of here, like, as soon as I start. Let's just see how quickly we can spam this down. Okay, not that long before we have to run to the altar and I have no energy. Well, we got a level, but that's going to be it for now. Don't even know if we would have enough. Why did I go to fucking miscellaneous? Yeah, I don't even know if that'd be enough for another level there. Oh, fuck, I forgot we can't bank this. It is what it is. Some inefficiency here. I just want to see if I can actually get back. I don't think I am going to. We can get as close as we can. You know what, actually, I I logged off 12 minutes early yesterday. I don't think it's out of the spirit of the series for me to run back to the tomb. It's not like I'm using the extra time to actually complete a challenge here. I'm just trying to make my life easier tomorrow. If people hate me for this, then I'm willing to be hated. <laughs> I want to start tomorrow floundering. I want to start tomorrow ready to go like I have the previous days. And you know, I did try and get back here on time. I, I did leave my activity with a minute still rather than staying till the very end and then running back here. Well, folks, a bit of another disappointing one today. Sorry about that. We got a prayer level, so that's cool. But yeah, we did, we did fail the tombs again, unfortunately. But I think we're prepared to try again. Do need to just maybe combine some of these. We're prepared to try again tomorrow with the same setup, but one extra prayer level. That's not what's going to make the difference. What's going to make the difference is if I die at Comfort as a hacker. That's all that's going to matter at this point. I feel like the Wardens is going to be relatively doable. Even though we haven't seen it at this level, I feel like we're going to be okay there. Acker is the problem. We need to get past Acker without a death because it costs us too much time and supplies to redo the boss the entire time through. I've just got to get better at come. The old age problem of life. Until I do though, I was in the middle of doing my outro and I just clicked stop recording. I don't know what's wrong with me. My brain is just not working right now. Maybe that's why I failed today. Leave a comment, leave a like, or leave a subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you tomorrow for once again, maybe the last episode, but of fucking who knows maybe it's just the third episode where i die to arca until then look after yourselves be lovely to one another and i'll see you on the next one